So homie has a lot to say about parenting. So we're going to check this out right here. Definitely with um, how people are letting their kids dress. So I'm really interested in seeing this for a video. Hey, yo, don't nobody know your daughter is 14, 15 years old, man. They don't, especially when they see them wearing these tight ass shorts with their ass cheeks hanging out the goddamn shorts. Oh. Men see physical. We see it. We don't know she 15, 14, man. That nigga just seen that shit and got pissed off because he got fucking confused. <laughs> he just seen a young chick that looked a little too good for his t his liking and probably tried to bust down on that and got fucking, fucking confused and was like, oh, nah, I need to make a public service announcement because this has to stop before I get got by them cops. Goddamn, my boy, I feel you. Keep talking your shit. We see it. We don't know she 15, 14, man. Sis, you don't see your daughter out there look like she having an ass out contest with you damn you ain't gonna say nothing or you just going you just gonna victimize the people that look at her mm. ain't you the one that bought them motherfucking clothes mm. huh ain't you the one that man check that shit it's warm as hell man you got these little girls walking down the street i'm riding down the block seeing all the kids for the prom so like all the little girls prom dresses got their ass and their titties out okay i feel them on that that's normal to you that ain't normal bro you don't feel weird about that shit? Nah, that's weird. You got grown men riding by, grown men with gray beards, looking at your little 12, 13, 14 year old daughter. Is you projecting my... Are you projecting my God? Cause you definitely a grown man with a gray beard. I don't know. I'm just playing folks, I'm just playing. I play a lot on my channel, dog. Don't take things too hard. I'm taking what he said to be serious, but we play around sometimes. Let's keep listening. Hey, they ain't looking at you looking at her ass. That don't bother you? Man, you need to get your shit together, man. Summertime. And I guess if you catch somebody looking at your kid, you catch somebody looking at your motherfucking kid, you gonna bust their ass, right? You gonna get the strap, grab the ratchet and bust their ass, right? Because they said something disrespectful to your 15 year old with them big ass titties, big ass hanging out with them little ass shorts, little ass clothes that you bought. You bought them shits. Look like you went and bought them shits from a store called Build the Little Hoe. <laughs> so somebody check them, right? So now the rest of the summer gonna consist of shootouts and dead bodies because you ain't be a better steward, be a good parent. Talk to them. And teach your child the importance of protecting their private stuff. I hear that. Your child in competition with you. Mm. That's cute to you? Hell no. Oh, you trying to let people see she get it from her mother? Huh? Just get your shit together. Bruh, pull up. Man, I understand you ain't with her no more. Pull up. You know your daughter getting older. She getting bitter. She's starting to develop now. Mm. Pull, up. pull up. Encourage bro. the mother to buy your daughter some training bras and shit. For real. Some respectful ass shorts, man. To, to get to the knees. You heard me? <laughs> Word up. Hey, Come hey. on, man. Let's be accountable to each other, man. That. Word up. Hear Especially that. in the day we got all these secret pervert, pervert ass, perverted ass, about the predatory ass dudes out here, man. And then now weed is legal. So that's telling your 14 year old, hey, come burn this blunt. And sit in the backseat of this caddy and call me daddy. Come oh. on, jump on the G ride. We out. Come on, y'all. It's levels to this shit. Get on top of your affairs, family, parents. Nobody want to hear nothing about all oh, what's happening in the violence in North. Nah, man, we starting that shit. Just be better parents to our kids out here. I hear that. Word up. And another thing, all you people out there screaming about the murders in the street, I got a question for you. Why every time you screaming about the murders in the street, you want to protest, bomb on the city hall, you want to march and anything, but why every time you get in an argument with somebody, you calling murderers? Hmm. You calling shooters? Hmm. How that work? Heard you. Man, get it together, man. Heard this you. This summer. This summer is our summer. We need to be better people, better parents, better accountable parents, better responsible, accountable parents for our own children, for our own city, for our own community, for our own village, for our own nation, man. Brother Malik speaks, man. Share this video. Man, homie was spitting off fast. Like I said, I was playing around. I play around all the time, but you guys gotta understand. If watch my channel, I'm gonna play around and I don't take things too serious. But his words should not be mistaken. He was spitting off fucking facts because that's some real shit. I seen a video of a prom, a girl at prom, and she has some barely anything covering up her breasts. And it's like, what parents will allow that shit? And you know, 2022, we have that a lot. Parents that just let their children just be some grown ass women. You know, over and over again, we get so far 
from where we need to be. And it's so damn disgusting. The children are the future. The children are the future. But the sad thing is, the parents that's been squandering and fucking things up for years are the ones that are teaching the children. Are the ones that are supposed to be holding the children accountable. And if they can't even spend for themselves, you know, or do the right thing for them themselves. So, so of course, a lot of these children are continue going to be continuing to be failed by the parents you feel me so this message is very important it's very potent and i appreciate homie going ahead and speaking that shit right there we all need to hear this we all need to see this man so um once again disregard my jokes at the beginning of the video man we just be trying to have a little fun while going ahead and get some good ass dope ass messages man i'm gonna get about here spray stacy you don't know the headline maybe listen this video is sponsored by stace.shop that's the home of my merch collection go ahead and get right over there 20 percent off everything on the damn store right now the link will be be down below. Spray station. I fuck with you. The reason why? Cause you, you fucks with me. Hey, I'm out.